Hey guys, it's Nick, aka the one and only Nick's Games. Today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to install a custom map on your Minecraft 1.8.1 server. Now, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm gonna be using the Nick's Craft World because I conveniently have that already installed in single player and can show you it worked by referencing them both back. But nevertheless, once you've got your custom map downloaded right here, which I will put a link where you can download a ton of awesome custom maps, by the way, uh, in the description down below. But once you've got your custom map downloaded, right here is mine, Nick's Craft again, because I I can easily reference it in single player and multiplayer and you've got your server started there's a video on your screen right now that will take you off and show you exactly how to start a 1.8.1 server that your friends can join and all that stuff go check that video out once you've got that server set up and running pretty easy to do i'll walk you through everything step by step once you've got that done come back to this video and uh, you can start installing a custom app on the server nevertheless once you've done that go ahead and open up your server folder and go into world you see a lot of stuff here and uh truth of the matter is it's all gonna go away no we don't want to do that what we want to do is then come over to nixcraft right and open it up or whatever your custom app is and make sure that there are comparing things here data dmi1 player data yada 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 all looks good well then guess what we do want to delete everything that was in the server 1.8.1 in your server world we want to delete this all make sure you don't want to keep it if you do, what you do is right-click, copy, right-click, paste, and then world-copy, you can rename that to world-backup or world-backup. Nevertheless, once you're in your world, you can delete everything in the server world. Let's get it into the trash bin there. And copy everything from the NixCraft folder into uh, world on the 1.8 server. Now what we want to do is come over here and uh, double-click on run. It will then open up this and go through everything, open all that stuff, allow access. Tons of stuff has to be done, but there we go. Now, we can go ahead and open up Minecraft, launch up Minecraft 1.8, and I can show you that uh, this is up and running. So let's go in here. I'm going to have to select 1.8.1 right there. Say profile, click play, downloads everything, launches this world. And I'll be able to show you. I'll join it in multiplayer, then go to single player, and then go back. So if we direct connect to my local IP there, it will log in, download terrain, and boom, the Nixcraft world, right? Let's turn up the render distance here so you guys can really see what's going on. But as you can see, there it is, Nixcraft world. Awesomeness, right? Awesomeness. Once you've done that, we can then come back over here disconnect from the server and go into single player on Nick's craft and I'll show you guys it's up and running and working over there too as you can see here I am that's where I was standing right there is the granite blocks boom just to prove it one more time we'll switch back to multiplayer into the server and as you can see it is up and running there as well so yeah guys that's pretty much it and as you can see I'm also in the server over there yeah, that's, uh, that's everything you need to know. That's how you can transfer a world, a single-player world, onto a server and get it up and running. Pretty cool, if you ask me. Pretty easy to do. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I make awesome Minecraft tutorials every single day of the week. You don't want to miss them, so why not go ahead and hit that subscribe button? Anyway, guys, I'm Nix Games. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I am out. Peace. I almost gave you a thumbs up instead of a peace sign. Sure. And here's some videos you guys probably want to go check out. On the left is how to start a Minecraft 1.8.1 server. Now that you've got your custom app and you know exactly how to install all that stuff and see how easy it is, why not go start the server itself? Go check that video out to see exactly how to do that. And on the right is Nick's Craft Episode 9. It is the Let's Play series where I built this world that uh, you're looking at right now. We're working on a sky village. It's going to be awesome. Go check out that video to uh, to see it happen. Also, in the bottom of your screen, there's a bunch of videos there that'll take you out to a channel where there's tons of videos on great growing your very own YouTube channel. Go check out those videos uh, and, and start growing on YouTube. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this video. I'm Nick's Games and I'm out. Peace.